Hello there. This is Monday the 3rd of April and this is the two yo lambs left to lamb and they're hanging on and on. We're not sure if they're due date because when we were scanning uh, the main flock these were a month later and the little fetuses weren't just visible to the scanning man so it's turned out these are two that we thought wasn't in lamb but they are and indeed a few of these yo lambs which have lambed in the back pen here they were thought they were empty too and turned out some of them's in lamb so that's all good news so what's happening these are going to go out to the field here because it's a lovely sunny morning now we were playing at Eden Grove Presbyterian the other night that was Saturday night past and by the time we went upstairs and got our supper after the concert got everything taken down back home to Gibson's house up the stairs all the gear logged away and I got home by the time I got into my bed which is here which I sleep out on it was three o'clock in the morning so I am still a bit sleepy and a bit groggy and I'm out in this shed 24 7 anyway until the last sheep lambs so I'm a bit groggy on it but there you are what's going to happen is we are moving the bed out of the way here And this group of girls here is going out into the field now, first of all, but I'll give them a wee taste of meal. I'll give this couple a little scoop of meal to keep them from getting overwrought when we're taking the rest out. Right girls, we're going out. Are all the lammies ready? Jay, you go on out, go on out. Come on girls. Come on. Out we go. Come on. Out we go. Come on girls, come on, come on, come on. Come back in, you rascals. Come back in out of that, you rascals. Look at that nice little lamb. A snuggly little lamb. Wait, where you go? One. No, out that way. This little skink or lizard, he was just at the doorstep when it came in, just like a piece of twig. And he was freezing, but I set him on top of a brown envelope on top of a top of the stove, which is nearly out, and it revived him. Anybody know what it is? Now I'm just going to cut a little bit of grass for the bottle fed lambs and here's my clipper. I just use the sheep clipper hand one for it cuts the grass nice and clean and you're not, when you pull it behind you're pulling roots up and soil up and stuff as well and you don't want little lambs getting that so here we go. you can see that's quite a nice nice bite of grass on that field there but uh, it's quite a bit of yellow in among it as well there when you see with all that rain we had on some of the other paddocks there they're dire looking yellow 
uh, but you know they're only getting just about dried out there such a bit of squelching was going on with all that rain we had okay lambies tell me what you think of this grass excuse me oh yes what do you think of the grass what do you think of the grass They're going to pick at it anyway. Are you picking at the grass? Put it in there. Let me see those lollies there.
Straight as the gate and narrow the way.